In campaign 2020, some L.A. County voters are going to the polls today for a special election. They're deciding the race to fill the 25th congressional seat vacated when Katie Hill resigned last year. CBS 2's Rachel Kim spoke with voters and has a look at what's at stake. It's the last day for voters in Simi, Santa Clarita, and Antelope Valleys to cast their ballots in a special election to decide who should fill the empty congressional seat vacated by Katie Hill. Republican Aerospace Executive Mike Garcia and Democratic Santa Clarita Assemblywoman Christy Smith are facing off to temporarily fill it. I don't think it matters what's going on in the world. This is how we get to have our say. And so that's what, it's super important. This election is supposed to be mostly vote by mail after Governor Gavin Newsom signed an executive order to protect public health and safety during the coronavirus pandemic. Election officials say they mailed a ballot to eligible voters in the 25th Congressional District, but people here told us they're glad they can still vote in person. That I did not get a ballot in the mail. I just got the official sample. If I did get a ballot, I'm not so sure that I trust the mail-in. I'm glad to come out here and vote. I'm glad so many people are out here voting as well. From the social distancing to the constant wipe downs, voters also notice the safety precautions in place to protect them and the poll workers. I think they've handled it well. They're sanitizing, they're keeping us apart. They're getting the line going through fairly quickly. I think they're doing a good job. Voters say they want their voices heard in what's expected to be a close race. You know, I had voted for Katie Hill as well. I voted for Mr. Garcia. The winner of this election will serve out the rest of Hill's term. Smith and Garcia will face off again in the November election for the chance to serve a full two-year term. No matter what vote it is, it's important, and everybody should come out and do that. If you're eligible and haven't voted yet, you still have time. You can do so in person at all nine voting centers, including this one, or leave your ballot at a designated drop-off location. You have until 8 p.m. Reporting from Valencia, Rachel Kim, CBS 2 News.